How to add your own mockups to Printify. Hello, hope you're doing good. I'm your host, Jason. In this video, I'll be showing you how to create mockups for free and how to add them to Printify. The first thing you want to do is open a new tab and you're going to go onto canva.com. And canva.com is a beginner friendly platform that you can use to create mockups for free. All you'll need to do is sign up using your email address. Once you are signed up, you are going to go over to the left hand menu option and you are going to tap right where you see apps. Then you are going to scroll down until you see mockups, you are going to tap on mockups. From here, I want you to select apparel or whatever item or type of item you are creating on Printify, you can select that particular category. But let's say for example, we are creating t-shirts, we are going to select apparel. Then we're just going to tap on t-shirts. From there, you can get more specific long sleeve t-shirt, men's t-shirt, women's t-shirt, kids t-shirt, unisex t-shirt. You can get more specific with it. Now, let's say, for example, we were to select women's t-shirt. After doing that, you can scroll down and you can see different images that you can use. Keep in mind, any one of the images that you see with the crown that says pro, You'd have to be a paid subscriber on Canva to use that particular template. But their paid plan is quite affordable also if it is a case that you would like to take this professional. Now, let's say for example sake, I want to use one of these images, so I'm going to be using this one. We'll simply tap on the image, then you're going to tap on select, and you're going to add in the image or logo that you want to add to your mock-up. You could select upload files and from there you can select the image. Now let's say for example sake I were to select this image. Then I'm just going to tap on open. After you have done that you'll tap on the particular image that you want to use. Then select next and you can see it has been added. Once it is to your liking you're going to tap on save mockup. Then after you have saved the mockup you're going to tap on download. Now that I've downloaded it, I can go into Printify. And I'm just going to go over to the left hand menu option and from there I'm going to tap on catalog. And I'm going to be creating a t-shirt, so I will select t-shirt. Then I can select the type of t-shirt, let's say for example this one. And we're just going to tap on start designing. After selecting start designing from here, you can go over to the left hand menu option and I'm going to tap on upload. And I'm going to be adding the same design since I already have a mock-up for it. I'm just going to adjust the size of the design. So I can adjust the size real quick. Once it is OK, we're just going to tap on Save Product in the bottom right hand corner. Once it has been saved, what I want you to do now is upload your own mock-up. And to do this, you'll go over to the top left hand corner and select Upload. Then you're going to simply tap on browse and you can select the mock-up image then tap on open. After doing that you're just going to tap on continue in the bottom right hand corner. Then tap on you can select the product so unlinked mock-ups or you can select white whichever one of these options you want you can select the variant as you can see right there. Then you'll tap on confirm. Now after doing this, what you're going to do next, as you can see right there, we now have our mockup. You can choose the mockup that you like. So we'll select that mockup and you can select whichever other one you'd like to use. So let's say for example, I'll select this one. So we have two mockups. I can select this one also. So three mockups. Then we'll tap on save selection. After you have done that, you can see the mockups right there. So this will be the primary mockups and we have two other mockups. You can scroll down and continue editing the description and so on of your product. Once you're finished, you'll select publish and you're going to give it a few seconds while the product is being added to your store. In this case, it is being added to my Shopify store. So once you see publish come up right here, you can go into Shopify or whichever platform and you'll be able to see the mockups that you have added on your product. So let's say I were to go into Shopify and refresh the page. 
After doing that, you can see the product right here. So if I were to select view, you can see it right there, the mock-up that I've created. Hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. If you did, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe.